Uh, hi everyone, I am Davi, uh, sales manager at OneOT, and with me here is uh, Jonna from TeamViewer IoT. And the aim of this uh, video recording is to uh, give an understanding and overview of the actual use cases regarding uh, TeamViewer IoT and uh, OneOT Global Connectivity uh, Partnership. So, hi Jonna. Hi Tavi. To kick off with the question, how do you deal with custom requirements when you are uh, providing one solution that fits all? Well, here we're leveraging our partner network like uh, with 1OT. You know, we want to focus on what we are best at, which is the software part. And uh, IoT includes a lot of puzzle pieces, which are then put together by our system integrators, by our partners out there. And network is something that we have been asked about quite often, uh, which is why we decided to go into this partnership together with 1OT and we see great value in it. And um, so far, our customers, customers as well. I agree. The same from, uh, from 1OT side, uh, we have uh, like not daily, but quite frequent inquiries regarding not only the connectivity part, but uh, also hardware part and uh, furthermore, the actual device management side. So I believe it's a definitely a plus for 1OT and TeamViewer IoT together. Uh, regarding one actual use case uh, I got in mind is uh, in the sector of uh, renewable energy. For example, uh, wind, wind energy and wind turbines, where the connectivity plays a very uh, huge role. In that sense, that uh, uh, usual case that uh, wind turbines are built in a very remote area where Wi-Fi connection or fiber or something like that is not accessible. So the 3G and 4G connectivity is needed there. But what about the uh, device management side in renewable energy? Yeah, as, as you mentioned, they are located in far offside locations. You're not building a power plant in the middle of the city. Um, and also not wind turbines. So here we are supporting our customers which want to connect to these offsite locations by both giving them the monitoring functions, so being able to be alerted when anything happens with uh, the wind turbine or the solar panel plant, um, and being able to react before any damages can happen. And that's something that our customers value greatly because these wind turbines, these solar panel uh, plants, they are very expensive. And when any damages happen and they need to do repairs, um, they're saving a lot of costs by being able to prevent this together with TeamViewer and uh, the 1OT connection with the network. I can only imagine that sending a, a maintenance worker up to the high tower of the wind turbine is uh, very, co uh, very costly, definitely. Definitely, yes. Regarding, uh, regarding another use case that I have in mind uh, in the field of uh, utilities or in the utility sector, for example, uh, smart, uh, smart uh, metering devices, where uh, one of the eSIM uh, can easily be implemented in the manufacturing process and send out to whatever part of the world and downloading the profile directly to the, to the eSIM. So, but uh, what about the uh, Team Variety agent side regarding uh, smart metering solutions? Yeah, here it's um, good that you mentioned it because we have a lot of customers coming now, especially after the current situation, um, to digitalize. And I think that's also a very important part to do because if you are not digitalized, then you need to shut down in the current uh, situation. So from the TeamViewer side, we enable something called predictive maintenance, um, being able to see what is happening um, on the other side and create rules so that there doesn't have to be even human interaction, that the machine can do most of the work by itself um, and to minimize the amount of work that needs to be put in, the amount of uh, people that need to be at the factory, the amount of people which need to interact. And uh, with the TeamViewer solution, after you have gotten uh, this information, you're also able to connect and to remotely control these machines. Uh, and this is only possible with internet. And um, the connection with 1OT here is also quite helpful uh, to these customers because um, that's the one and most important part of having TeamViewer, to have an internet connection. 
So from the Teamviewer side, I also have one question for 1OT, and that is within the agriculture sector, because we have quite a lot of customers coming from there as well, and they're also located in quite off-site locations. Do you also have use cases within this sector uh, with 1OT? Uh, thank you, Jana. Thank you for the question. And indeed, uh, agriculture is uh, one sector we are uh, definitely in, and. Uh, uh, the main main uh, use cases there are uh, uh, on the roaming side uh, are the uh, different sensors, let's say sensors for monitoring the soil, uh, sensors for uh, the correct irrigation processes and things like that. So the global roaming co connectivity in the agriculture side is definitely definitely a must uh, in that industry. And where do you see the pluses of TeamViewer plus 1OT there? I can definitely see the plus on the device management uh, side in, uh, in, in whole because uh, there are a lot of uh, different, uh, different software providers uh, that you can implement but getting uh, the full turnkey solution from, uh, from a provider is definitely something that uh, agriculture companies are interested in rather than dealing with uh, different companies, different uh, softwares and so on. So the full turnkey solution I think is, uh, is the key here. Agreed. Thank you, Tavi. Thank you for watching the video. Uh, if you have uh, more uh, uh, questions regarding uh, TeamViewer IoT uh, and uh, one OT connectivity, please don't hesitate to contact us. And uh, thank you, Jana, for this uh, call and video. Yeah, thank you from the TeamViewer side.